Hi, good morning. I'm here with the copycat journal. I was looking for it all over and I couldn't find it. I only found this. I'm like, what's going on? Oh, oh, I didn't even stick it down. Look at that. I did not stick properly my double-sided tape. However, <laughs> I look everywhere and then I realized that I actually finished two signatures already and this is the start of the third one. Are we good? I remember, oh yes, we were making a tag. I remember that. How did I even finish the tag? I don't remember that. <laughs> oh, now I know. I have this and I found it randomly <laughs> while doing another video and I'm like, I, I, I wanted it somewhere. I think I wanted it to hang down here. Didn't I? I think I wanted it to. So um, let me get an eyelet. Yeah, it's all a little chaotic. I'm not having a good time. I'm really sorry that every time I come on here, I'm telling you I'm not having a good time. But it is what it is. It was very bad yesterday, actually. And I think it's because I got stressed out because of the doctors. But today, I couldn't sleep all night. Is that the bigger one? No, it's not. This one is just trying to make a hole here. I can't sleep for the past few nights. I just cannot sleep and I am having troubles. And oh, God. oh, oh, well, I should have glued it and maybe paid attention to it. Uh Oh, I made the hole on the wrong part. Hmm. Am I okay with that? I think I'm okay with that. It's going to be a little upside down, but it's not that bad. I'm just putting the eyelet in here. I need to see while I do that. Okay. All right. And I am going to hammer it. Oh, everybody's asleep and I'm going to hammer. Well, I only did it for a second there, but still, I hope they didn't wake up. Okay, I need to open this one and I need to push this one through if I can. I don't know if it's my fibro doing something new or whatever, but my back is just hurting. I cannot sleep. All right, so this is how it goes. Did it glue down now? Is it going to come off again? I'm also going to glue this one down because it's just paper. Did I make this tag for this part anyways? I think I did. Okay, there you go. And there's the hanging thingy. I'm going to glue this part down here. It's just paper, you know, copy paper, very thin paper. So I think it's gonna rip if it's just like that. So let's put some glue on there. I got so frustrated with my doctors yesterday. You have no idea. With the doctors, with the pharmacy, with the whole system here in America. <laughs> I'm sorry, but yeah, I got frustrated. So last week I spoke to my psychiatrist and um, I don't know, I think I talked to them, maybe not. However, he said, you know what? He doesn't believe that that's big anxiety what I have. He said, I see so many patients who are told that they are having anxiety and three years later they find something medically wrong with them when he said that i i almost fell over i'm like really <laughs> thank you for saying that because i hear so many people you know saying that all they hear is anxiety 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 and now a psychiatrist is telling me that you know that i'm not crazy <laughs> basically so yeah however i was just woo you know so then we were talking and um i told him you know it might be spasms in my esophagus and when i went to the emergency room they gave me an ativan and it relieved it so um and he said oh yeah because it's like smooth muscle and um ativan relieves and whatever it relieves smooth mus muscles oh my god i can't even talk yeah, however, so I asked him, could you prescribe me some? And he said, well, my policy is I don't prescribe more than three in a month. So three pills. I'm like, oh God, there we go. 
What am I supposed to do with three pills? I'm not going to survive because I can take it for a day or two, but then I really, for, I really need a little bit of relief because I cannot go on. Otherwise, I'm going to end up in, in the emergency room. But I said, okay, I'll, I'll take those. But he said, you know, if you go to your doctor and he wants to prescribe you more, I don't mind. I'm not against the medication. It's just my policy is I don't prescribe more than three a month. I'm like, all right, just, you know, go ahead, prescribe me three, and then I will ask my normal doctor. So he did, and I picked it up, and then I called my doctor, and I asked for a refill for Ativan because he prescribed it to me before. And um, he gave me a refill and then the pharmacy had a problem filling it. So I called it because on my app it said, you know, we have problems filling it. So I called the pharmacy and they said, well, doctor, the psychiatrist prescribed you three and he put on the bottle or whatever on the prescription must last a month. So that's why they cannot give me more. I'm like, oh my God. Now I have to call the doctor, either the, my PCP and make him overwrite it or the psychiatrist and make him kind of take it back that it's, that I cannot have anything else because his prescription must last that long. But he told me, you know, you can, you can get it from your other doctor if you want to. It's just my policy. So, you know, I don't know. I'm kind of, I'm so frustrated. I was like, this does not happen in Germany. I don't know. We don't have, nobody's counting pills in Germany. You know, if you would, which one do I like more? If you would go to Germany and um, let's say the doctor prescribed you, I don't know, ibuprofen. He will prescribe you the small or the big pack. That's it. There is no five pills, 10 pills, seven pills, three pills, one pill. You get a package. It's a box, the original box of the medication with this aluminum thing where you kind of, you know, squeeze the pills out. That's what you get here. <laughs> I don't know. My, my dentist prescribed me Valium and then I went to pick it up. It was one pill, like in a big bottle. We don't have bottles. Is it okay to just put one and then have here like kind of for writing? I don't know. I think maybe. Or do I have the bigger flowers? I have some somewhere here. Maybe I have like a, a long pretty flower. Let me see. This one is cool. This one is cool, but it's not very long. I'm trying to find a flower that I pre-printed once long time ago, but they are very short. All of them are short. So do I want a short one? I don't think so. I have some that I have cut. No, I don't like it. No, I don't think so. I'm going to stick with this one with my first choice. Always stick with your first choice. Always. Do I have different flowers? Ooh, I have more flowers. I'm trying to find something. I like this one, but I'm not 100%. You know, not 100%. I feel like maybe this part needs a little more something. I kind of like this one too. Could I do two of them? I probably even could. Hmm. I think I'm going to do two of those. Are they all the same? Yes, I think so. Okay, okay. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Do these. Okay. I really have to use a die cut of mine, but I don't think it, it's just brown and brown. It's kind of, I'm missing a little bit. 
of color. I can't believe I'm saying that, but I am missing a little bit of color on there. Yeah, so however, because yesterday was Saturday, I couldn't reach. I asked the, the pharmacy because I was just curious. What do you do if you're out of your medication and it's a Saturday and you know, and I, I would need the medication. She was like, yeah, call your doctor because they um, put in the prescription today. So they are working. I'm like, he's not working on a Saturday. I don't know how you got the prescription from him on a Saturday, but I know he doesn't work. And she was like, yeah, not my problem. And I was just thinking, okay, you know, I don't need it. I'm not going to die. I'm not, I still have, I didn't take all of the three that my... Um, psychiatrist prescribed so I'm okay over the week a weekend but I was just thinking so what do people do if they it might be like a medication that is you really need it you know so what, what do you do you wait till Monday nobody I don't understand if the doctor prescribed something you should be giving it it's the same thing like when my doctor prescribed me pain pills um, tramadol he prescribed me 30 tramadol a long time ago I barely ever take any, but <clears throat> he prescribed me 30. The pharmacy gave me 24 or something like that. And I was like, why? Oh, it's our policy. So when I went to the doctor the next time or a while after that, um, whenever I needed more, I told him, well, you don't need to write down 30 because they are not going to give me 30 anyways. And he was shocked. He was like, what? No. I'm gonna make them give you 30. <laughs> so that time it worked. Every time before that, they would not give me 30, even though the doctor prescribed that many. So I don't know. However, I'm putting some tape here because I think it's gonna look better. And some hair, like, you know, as if it's, if I had to, um, she had like a um, dry flower a dried flower she used I don't know from her son or something if I remember correctly but I am I don't have a dried flower so I'm using these and I'm kind of pretending as if they are dried flowers right yeah I'm kind of pretending here okay so there's that all right what goes on here? Oh, I had this one. I was thinking, you know, I can totally use it somewhere. So I'm thinking I can totally use it here, right? No? I don't know if it's not too narrow. Let's see what else I have. My box again here. Do I have bigger folded paper? I do have this. Let's see. Because I know these are leftovers from my um, very first journal, I think, Halloween. And then I might have the red. What, what else is bigger? Nothing else is bigger here. I still have my leftover from what I made myself. I'm not giving it, you know, I'm just using a tiny bit at a time. Even though I can make myself more, apparently I'm not doing so. So, let's see. I either I do this or I do this and then I can make another pocket like I did before. What do you think? I might just do that. Hmm. What do you think? Or is like half of it okay? I don't know. I do not know. Or is this okay? Maybe this is even okay. I gotta use up the small one, right? So let me punch. Here. Here. And the opposite side. Here and here, okay? I'm not even putting my punch away anymore. Oh, I haven't crafted in a little while. I really have not. I don't know if I'm going to do anything on this. But this is going to be here. And if it sticks out a little, I will be okay with that. I just need to distress it. <coughs> yeah. 
so my plan oh i see my gi tomorrow guys not my gi even this is one so stanford ordered two tests and i asked if i can do them closer to me because i don't want to stay in a hotel while doing the test and drive all the way i don't know to whatever bay area and i asked if i can do it here and they said if i find somebody closer who does these tests they will just send a referral and they did but now i have to see them first i don't know why but i will on monday to tomorrow tomorrow so next time i come in here or the time after that it depends if i come in today again then i won't know anything but other than that i might have answers to when i'm gonna get the test done so we'll see Okay, now just pay attention that it's the right way around. Okay, and I think I'm going to put some washi here. Let me put my flowers away, because they are in my way. I'm going to put some washi, because I'm using up my washi now, as we all know. Do I put this one there? Just the burnt part? Yeah, why not? Let's do this. This is upside down and you can tell. Mm -hmm. Does it even matter? It does not really matter. I can just do it. How much of a washi do I want here? Maybe that much. Okay. Using my washi, I can't believe it. Now I just need to take the backing off. Yeah, I know, I know. I should get something to help me, but I won't. I won't, because I can do it myself. Okay, I'm going to push it closer to my eyes. Otherwise, it's not going to be good. Okay, a little bit of washing. Dunyan. We need a book light. That's okay. And do I have all of my... Did I cut more? Hope so. At least one, please. Yes, I do have one. Okay, I need to cut more of these because we're gonna, gonna use more. And now I'm gonna make a booklet real quick. Just the size, kind of the size of this. And then I'm gonna wrap it right here. And I'm gonna make maybe two or three of these. Oh, look, I have this one. That's so cool. I can just put it on top, right? That's too many holes, doesn't it? <laughs> I think it's too many holes. Hole here, hole there. Holes everywhere. But I do have this one, though. And I can make it a little shorter. And maybe one more, but then, then I will be done. I have the leftover here. That's it. Oh. What? this going on. If I put you here and then I put you, if I put you here and then I put you here, we should be able to see all of them a little bit. Yes, we are. And I'm going, I'm going to just glue it a little bit so it's stuck. It doesn't matter. I'm going to put something on top anyways. Just put some glue in between the layers, please. That's all I want. And then I'm going to put this one on top. Right? Right. No. First, I would like to distress this one. And then I would like to put some... Do I have anything left over here? I don't see anything, so I'm just going to grab some from here and hope for the best that it's enough. And let me put some here and some here. Once again, I'm just doing the same thing I did 100 times before. Okay. Okay, can we please? Oh my God, I cannot catch it. There you go. I'm just gonna make it not. 
Ah, you see? You see what's going on? My hands are just not working. Okay, I made a knot. I can cut this one even shorter. And now I'm going to glue this on top of that. So this way there's kind of a booklet. I'm gonna leave a little bit on top because it's like ripped and I think it looks really good. I should have, you know what I didn't do, but yeah, well, I should have glued it and then maybe done the holes, but I didn't, so it's okay. I'm just gonna glue it here, yep. And then I think I'm gonna call it a day. I, for some reason, not feeling very well right now. I need to see what Bruno's doing. Anyways, not all the way to the fold because I think it's gonna be hard to sew later. Okay, so there is that. Let's see. Mm, I'm also going to put one of Eva's sayings on here, I think. Yeah, it's good. Stop being afraid of what could go wrong and think of what could go right. Yeah. I need that. I need that. I don't have that. Okay. Now I'm actually thinking I would like to. Do I have like something pretty? in front of me or around me or like it's just a tiny little flower or something or oh, maybe not no i think maybe we are good or oh, down here i'm missing something let me see what is this oh i don't even know what my something different. Oh, how about the Tim Holtz flowers? He got tiny flowers, I think. No, that's too big. Way too big, Mr. Holtz. Do I have like a little tiny... Oh, I have this. That's it. Oh, I have a butterfly. Oh, what? I think it's a moth, but who cares? <laughs> oh my god, I lost my number. Oh. Come on. Let me see if I like I think I like it there. You see, that's why it's kind of something on there. So I, I'm going to put the tiny little. I think I stamped it. And then fussy cut it, if I remember correctly. Okay. And does would a number go on top? Or would it cover I think it would cover everything up. Okay, number next time. But the moth or butterfly or whatever it is can stay here. Alright, guys, I'm I'm done for today. Or for now. Maybe I'll come back after a break, but I don't know. But this is the next part. We're moving. We're moving. I don't know how many signatures she got, but I got two already. And that's my third one. So thank you so much for being here and spending time with me. I really appreciate more than you think. And I hope you are all healthy and happy and enjoying your day. And I see you soon. Bye-bye.